Hey guys, and welcome to today's video. I'm gonna be starting a new series on my channel called TikTok Made Me Do It. I'm sure you guys have all seen the videos of TikTok Made Me Do It. Um, if, you, if you're not familiar with it, this is going to be a series of videos of things that I found on TikTok that was really cool that I wanna try for myself. And pardon my loss of voice, still battling with my cold, not coronavirus, I tested negative twice for corona so i did the rapid test and it was negative but they say that there's only a 30 percent chance when it's negative of being correct so they re-swab you and then they send it away the longer test both negative so this is just bronchitis i am on um an antibiotic and a steroid i am feeling better just my voice is still hanging by a thread uh, more so than usual. So today's first video for TikTok Made Me Do It is going to be the Chaffles. So for some reason, Chaffles has gotten a really popular niche on TikTok. I've been making Chaffles, as we know, for like over a year now, and I'm obsessed with them. But now they've become pretty popular on TikTok and they've come up with some new ideas. So for today's video, I'm gonna be trying five different chaffle recipes. We're gonna be trying the avocado chaffle, the fried onion chaffle, the fried pickle chaffle, the fried zucchini chaffle, and the pepperoni chaffle. I think I've made the pepperoni chaffle before on my channel, but we're just gonna do it again. And then at the end, Jean and I are gonna taste test them all and just let you know what we think of them, which ones are our favorites and which ones we didn't like. And then in the next segment, we'll find something else, whether it's a life hack, a craft, another recipe. I don't know, you'll just have to tune in and find out. So let's get on with the truffle making. So this is the beginning of the series that I'm gonna do called TikTok Made Me Do It. And I'm gonna try all kinds of things found on TikTok. So the first thing is chaffles. So we all know that I love making chaffles. I've made chaffles on the channel many, 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 many times. And I'm like the queen of chaffles. So this is a keto low carb recipe. It is low carb friendly, keto friendly, and it is delicious. I have not tried these types yet, but I am like obsessed with chaffles. So I'm imagining these will be delicious. So today we're gonna try five different kinds of chaffles. Very easy, they're all two ingredients each and I'm sure they're going to taste amazing. So we have the fried zucchini chaffle, fried onion chaffle, avocado chaffle, pickle chaffle, fried pickle chaffle, and a pepperoni chaffle. So with those ingredients, all you're gonna need is some shredded cheese. This is just a blend of some cheese that we had in the fridge, little bits we had left. This is a blend of Fiesta, shredded Fiesta blend, and mozzarella, but you can definitely use other. We have some Mexican style blend cheese, as well as some shredded cheddar cheese blend. So I don't know exactly what we'll be using, but we're gonna start with this since it's opened, and then if we need more, then we'll just move on from there. Of course, you're gonna need your little chaffle, your mini little chaffle iron that I have here. I cleaned it really well because it can get pretty messy um, from the oil and the grease. So what you're gonna wanna do is put your chaffle iron on a paper plate or paper towels to catch some of the runoff because obviously the cheese is going to be oily and you're gonna have quite a bit of oil. Um, you're gonna need a vegetable slicer, a fork and a knife for cutting. So without further ado, let's stop yapping and let's get start cooking. All right, we're gonna start with the avocado chaffle. So I've got my avocado and I'm just going to get the little guy out of his shell. All right, and I'm just going to slice this. So I'm just gonna slice this into thin pieces. We're gonna make two of each chaffle because of course there's two of us. So this is going to be our lunch. 
ish. All right, so we're gonna take and put a little bit of shredded cheese on the bottom of the chaffle maker. You're not gonna want a lot, just a little spruce. I don't know, spruce doesn't sound right. A little, dash. yeah, a little dash on the bottom. And then you're gonna come over here with your sliced avocado. Now these TikTok recipes, they don't actually tell you how much to use. So I'm gonna just gonna kind of guess. And then you're just going to cover it up with some more cheese. You're gonna close your lid. And this is going to cook for three to four minutes. And a good indication of when it's done is when you see the steam stop coming up from the maker. All right, it's been three minutes. Looks chaffly. <clears throat> Looks crispy. Smells good. Yes. There's our first avocado chaffle. And that's approximately four minutes. Yeah, approximately four minutes. So you could probably back off to about three minutes since it's looking a little on the dark side. Do yeah. you want it that dark? No, it could be a little lighter. Okay. I mean, it, the, the darker it is, the crunchier it's going to be. That's right. the whole premise of the... Okay, so it's preference. All right. You want to cut those avocados in half? Close the lid and do three more minutes. Alexa, set timer for three minutes. Three minutes. All right, avocado chaffles done. All right, next we're gonna make the fried zucchini chaffle. So I've got my handy dandy peeler here. I'm just gonna go ahead and peel the skin off of this. All right, and we will get rid of the skin. That's my cue. That's his cue. Make it disappear, babe. All right, we're gonna take and do some slices of the zucchini. All right, we're gonna set this aside. Lay the zucchini on the paper plate, on the paper towel, folded like so. And we're gonna stick this in the microwave for about one minute. Start with 30 seconds. Test it out. No, I need 30 more seconds. All right, this is what they look like after about 45 seconds in the microwave. You just wanna put them in there so they get kind of soft and not actually cooked. I mean, you can't really cook a zucchini in 45 seconds, but you just want it soft so when you put it in here, it's not, you don't have that crisp when you bite into it when you're done. So we're just gonna do like we did with the others. Lay down your cheese. Then we're just gonna go in here with the zucchini. Cover that with some more cheese. Alexa, set a timer for three minutes. All right, three minutes and our fried zucchini chocolate's done. We need our plate, Mr. Helper. You got it. I got it. All right, next chaffle, we're going to, I put some more cheese in the bowl. This is a blend of the Mexican blend as well as sharp cheddar. And lay our zucchini down. And I guess however much zucchini you want to use, it's up to you. There's no, there was no science behind it or there was no actual recipe, like amounts. It's just up to you. And a tip too, when you're making these, you want to try to keep the cheese inside the grill and not have it like sticking out around the sides because that's what makes it really messy and it will stick and burn and stick to the outside of the chaffle maker. My poor little, this poor little chaffle maker has been through so much and I just, in preparation for this video, cleaned it up really well because it had cheese stuck to it and 
when I would make it with almond flour, it had almond flour stuck to it and grease and all kinds of nastiness. So you wanna make sure your cheese stays as much as possible inside the iron. Zucchini truffle, done. done. All right, let's move on to the pickle truffle. I need the knife, there we go. I was gonna say, where's the knife? So usually you would want dill pickle chips, but we just have whole pickles. I'll take the, oh shoot, that's a little hot there, guys. That's a little, little on the warm side. Let's hold on, let me just take that out there. So we're just gonna do thin slices of pickle. And again, it doesn't matter. I get, well, I mean, you don't want like real thick slices of pickle, obviously. I like That's pickles. kinda thick. I like pickles. Kinda like you like turtles. I like turtles. <laughs> As before. And more cheese. Close the lid. Alexa, set timer for three minutes. <gasps> Alexa, stop. Okay, then three minutes. Huh, that's uh, interesting. Yeah, that's... She's like melted away from the... Yeah. All right, I think we have our first fail. Perhaps. Looks looks a little failish. Well, it will probably work, but well, this is I just changed the cheese. This is the first one with the thick cut. Yeah. You gonna get it there? Oh, I need help. It still looks okay, but it doesn't look as covered as the other ones. No, it somehow melted away. I'm curious. Oh, it looks like an absolutely gorgeous chaffle. So it all melted down and went to the bottom. However, we'll still eat the same. Mm -hmm. You're all right, babe. Mm -hmm. All right, next we're gonna do the onion chaffle, the fried onion chaffle. So we're just gonna do thin slices of onion. Add your cheese, add your onion. More cheese. Close the lid. Alexa, set timer for three minutes. Alexa, how long is left on the timer? Alexa, Alexa stop. stop. Alexa, stop. <laughs> Oh, oh, we had spillage. Mmm, that smells good. I sure Actually, I like, it does. I like onions. What do you like more, onions or turtles? Turtles. I like turtles. All right, second one coming up. All right, onion chaffles done. All right, for our last chaffle, we're gonna do pepperoni chaffles. Are done. Now we'll taste test them. Here is our array of TikTok made me do it chaffles, and now we will do a taste test of them. All right, we finished making all of our chaffles. Now we're gonna taste test them. What we're do we gonna... have? What is, what is this? 
We're gonna start with the avocado. All right, avocados. Crunchy. Creamy. Mm-hmm. Interesting. I'm not too familiar with chaffles, so I'm still trying to process the experience. Are they supposed to be like this crunchy? Mm -hmm. I guess it's not too bad for it being cheese. It's interesting. I think it's good. Tastes good, yeah. Not bad. Although I will say, I think if I'm going to eat my avocado, I'd rather have it just plain, not chaffled. Not it bad, is though. good though. No, it is good. <clears throat> but I'd rather eat my my um, avocado like on toast, mm. like avocado toast, or just on a salad. That's your preference. Okay. Yeah, but it's good. Very good. So. What's what's uh, the history behind this? Like this this girl just came up with this. Well, it's on not just TikTok. one person. These are an array of different people that came up with these different chaffles because chaffles like this trend now. It's a huge trend because it's keto friendly. It's just cheese and the other ingredient. Cheese is a huge keto ingredient. And this one is the zucchini chaffle. like there's nothing in there I guess I'm just not a big zucchini fan there's not much flavor no you could put some spices on it if you want probably I never considered that but sure all right we'll do so what's this one this one here we'll do the pickle pickles pickle chaffle I say cut them thinner so it won't do that little number. Looks like all the cheese went no, around, right off. around mm -hmm. the pickles. The other side looks beautiful. Mm -hmm. So far the pickle is my favorite. It is good, I, li I like it. This is the onion. Onion. Onion chaffle. Can't fail with cheese and onion. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's almost like a um onion ring. Yeah. Yep. That's good. Onion's very good. Mm -hmm. I like it. I like it. I like it. Pickle and onion are, are on up there. Avocado's yes. pretty darn good. I guess the least favorite so far would be the, what was that? Zucchini, you said. Z zucchini, I just didn't, there's not much flavor. Now this one probably is gonna be really good. It's pepperoni. pepperoni. Can't fail. Gonna be good. Pepperoni, onion, with some avocado. That would be good. Mm-hmm. Interesting. My first time chaffling. Ashley, you have had chaffles, but you we've made the I've made you. You've never had this, but you you've had the almond flour, the ones that are like actual waffles. Yeah. Right. He's never had the actual just cheese. No. Chocolate. It's not bad. It, it it works. I mean, it tastes good. So which one is your favorite? 
We'll put pepperoni aside because that's just kind of a given. That tastes really good. I mean, you could that 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 one's really it tastes good. like a pizza. Yeah, it's kind of like a pizza. Onions really good. I, I'm just a big onion fan though. Anything with onion, garlic, sautéed onion. This kind of tastes like onion rings. Mm -hmm. Pickles. These are really good. I liked them. Um, let's just say I liked everything but the zucchini. The zucchini mainly just because there's no flavor. I think zucchini had a flavor. My favorite would have been is the onion and then the zucchini. Least favorite is the avocado. Really? That's... They all taste really good to me. Yeah, they do to me too. Like, equal. We will see you next time for another edition of TikTok Made Me Do It. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone.